Hi Gemini, it's Elle here to do a quick reading for you. We're going to see how you feel about your person and how they feel about you. All right, so let's get into it. Thank you, God, for blessing Gemini with a clear, concise message from you. All links are below, Gemini, if you want to get your own personal reading or get in contact with me. So let's see how you feel about your person. How does Gemini feel about, okay, the Ten of Wands. So you feel like this is, um, they're a burden right now. It could be, you could feel like this is karmic. A karmic situation is toxic. It has become unhealthy. Um, you could just, you could feel like you're just, engaging with this person but you don't know where it's going you don't know what the end is going to be you can feel like you just keep showing up for the relationship but there's no intention and set intention set here like we intend to get married move in together we you know it's just no intention it's just kind of like um chaos but it's, it's like a quiet chaos it's like we just keep engaging with each other we keep waking up with one another we keep hanging out we keep having sex we you know but what is the end game here the knight of cups came out so you can feel like maybe um they're just uh you know continuously making you feel good or making you fall in love with them but there's no real grounding of the situation you also feel like this person is still in search of new people the you or the other person feels like um well this is how you feel about your person you feel like they are this is a person who likes the newness of relationships. Like they like when you first meet someone and you fall in love and it, it feels good. And then when it gets kind of, you know, real or serious, you feel like they, um, they want to look for something else. Um, they just have unrealistic expectations for romantic relationships. You know, this is how you feel about your person. Like they don't want to do the work. Um, they like the ooey ooey, you know, like they like the ooey gooey of a relationship. They like the, you know, the falling in love, but they don't like the maintaining or the maintenance of a relationship. Let's see how your person feels about you, Gemini. How does your person feel about Gemini? Uh, the the uh, Hierophant. So they feel like you're very structured, routine, um, that you're trying to make sense out of this chaos, order out of chaos here. Maybe you feel like you want to take it to counseling. You're really trying to um, merge the two. It's like you're trying to have some status quo in the relationship. Like, this is what we do. This is where we're going. This is what we need to be doing. We need to have more um, structure, more traditionalism. You have the page of cups. So your person feels like um, you're trying to insert more romance and become emotionally mature. And um, maybe even like uh, uh, start something new. In the relationship this could be a new baby or i heard a dog or just doing something that really brings in new energy into the connection here um let's see what the advice is for you gemini so it's like you're trying to your person sees you as trying to make it work um maybe even pop the question okay um if not pop the question or you're trying to yeah if you want someone to pop the question uh you're trying to maintain your uh your emotions and not be erratic or just immature. You're trying to be more romantic, more giving. Advice for Gemini. Let's see. Advice for Gemini. Let's see. Advice for Gemini. Uh, the will of will of change, will of fortune. Okay, so let things change naturally. Um, this could be your soulmate. This is destiny. It was destined for you to meet this person. Is it destined for you to be with them forever? Only time will tell. Only you know that. Um, something about changing, changing your mind also. Yeah, let time tell. The seven of pentacles. Finish what you started. Don't walk away. Do know that things will change. This is the ebb and flow of relationships. Right now, there might not be a whole lot of activity between you and your person. But um, continuously, you know, uh, hang in there. Right now, you can feel like you don't know where it's going with this person. Let's see. Um, and what is um, the advice? Oh, we did advice. Oh, excuse, sorry. What is the outcome? The outcome for Gemini. If they take the advice of the cards, what is the advice? Listen to your intuition. Okay, very nice, the sun card. Things will become more positive. So the advice is wait for change, change your mind. Do know that you planted good seeds. Don't give up, finish what you started with this person. It just might be a period of dysfunction right now, but um, things will come out of that stuck, stagnant uh, 
place, okay? All right, so let's see. Uh, what is the hidden element when it came out fast? All right, get wild, keep the faith. So they, they want you to keep the faith in your relationship. Things are, it's really gonna change. It's really gonna turn around. Um, some of you need to go to spiritual leaders with a higher friend or counselors or therapists, group therapy or something like that. Uh, this is what I have for you, Gemini. Go over to the website, book your reading there, ask a question or two by texting it to the number below. You can also donate to the channel. Um, by clicking the Buy Ella Coffee link. Catch me live every Tuesday, Thursday, and Sunday night, 8.30 p.m. Eastern Standard Time tonight. Thank you guys. Many blessings to you. Take care.